We're finally nearing the end of February, the month where studios historically hide their lamer movies. And one of the last cinematic speed bumps is Will Smith's Con Man Caper Focus, which just can't seem to hold our attention. Written and directed by Glenn Ficarra and John Requa, who previously teamed for the romantic comedy Crazy Stupid Love, the film follows Nikki, played by Will Smith, and his comely new friend Jess, played by the Wolf of Wall Street's Margot Robbie, whom Nikki is schooling in the art of scams, big and small. Smith and Robbie make a cute pair, but they don't exactly inspire thoughts of a love or crime match made in heaven, or New York, or New Orleans, or Buenos Aires, the three cities the film visits in three distinct acts, only two of which really work. This is the kind of movie that gets the small details right, but the big ones wrong. And while Focus ultimately loses focus, it does feature some of the more interesting supporting characters I've seen in the genre. These include Adrian Martinez as Nikki's scruffy associate, a foodie who steals from ATMs to finance his line of gourmet gravies. And there's Gerald McRaney, a mobster seen it all security chief who explains why he hates Twitter even when he's threatening to shoot up a place. These are fun diversions that lead to a wind-up that leaves us feeling more like victims of a cheap shell game than observers of a smartly executed plan. But while focus isn't as bad as After Earth, Smith's sci-fi bomb from 2013, we can't say we weren't warned. Smith has been telling us about cons the entire movie. At the Star.com, I'm Peter Howell.